But my parents always wanted us to be the best we could. All the things I think about doing, I was thinking about those people before me. I also think about my two little girls too. I want them to live in a better world tomorrow. From your perspective, how would you define culture? Culture is two words. Relationships plus meaning. David reminds us that representation deeply matters. So my name is David J. O'Connor. My traditional Anishinaabe name is Bogwagniwin. When I translate to English, it means broken wing. But the meaning behind that name means he overcomes, never gives up. He provides incredible trainings to students and teachers throughout the state. I am the American Indian Studies Consultant here at the Wisconsin Department of Public Construction, teaching and learning about our First Nations histories, cultures, and tribal sovereignty. His advocacy towards Act 31 and its integration in the school districts is unparalleled. Without his work, I don't think the school scape would be as nearly as diverse and as accepting as it is now. Our ancestors are always by our side. Look at those people right next to you and think about how much they really want to see you not only be successful later on, but now. I'm trying to have them shift from teaching about cultures to teaching culturally. He has been great in making sure they realize that each tribe is different and unique. And we are so thankful for the work that he does. To me, teaching about cultures, like I was taught our classroom educators, that's where you have an opportunity to be engaged in dialogue with your students every step of the way. And David is one of those catalysts of change on the landscape in the educational realm and that bubbles over into good things for humanity. What is indigenous histories? So I pluralize that on purpose. A lot of times when I have conversations, people always talk about it's Native American history. No, no, it's Native American histories. It's like just Native American cultures. I think it's a lost opportunity to not forget the vast, amazing cultures out there, our histories are out there, of our different indigenous populations throughout the United States. We're very diverse. We have 12 nations in Wisconsin. We have over 574 fairly recognized nations across the United States. Plus we have over 60 plus state recognized nations. Because to me, it's not just teaching the information, it's about really believing in it and actually understanding what does that mean in terms of who you are in that histories and cultures, understanding that you also have a story as well. I think it's a beautiful example of karmic reciprocity. The universe saying back to David, thank you for your good work, thank you for being a loving, caring person, and uh, keep going. For me, when I think about my two girls, I just want them to be happy. I want them to live in a better world. But just even more importantly, I just want them to be Ava Marie, and I want them to be Eliane and nobody else.